We've got to get this bridge down. must have something to do with it. Yes, these are Akavir symbols. Here, let's see. We have the symbol for king, the war there. And of course, the symbol for dragon. That's the one that appears to have a sort of arrow shape. Yes, right. The symbol of the pillar of the left. Given that Skyhaven Temple was sealed against the return of the Dragonborn, I will try turning all the pillars to that symbol. We must be getting close. We should proceed cautiously. How do we find the entrance to Skyhaven Temple? We should be careful. There's no telling what traps and wards the ancient blades may have set. Okay. We'd best be careful in here. No. Why are you going so quick, Wait. buddy? Be careful. Why are you stopping? We should be careful here. See these symbols on the floor? Mm hmm. Esbern's right. Look like pressure plates. Mm hmm. Be careful. Safe. When's it safe? Be careful. Is it safe, buddy? I think we gotta follow. Be careful. We'll cross once it's safe. Yeah, you can wait there all day, buddy. You gotta follow these symbols.
we go. Wonderful. Remarkably well preserved. You see how the ancient blades Try revered the blood of Cyrodiil? think of it. Isn't it amazing? Mm, it is. Carry on. Ah, thank you. Excellent. Now, where were we? Look, here is Aldrin. This panel goes back to the beginning of time. When Aldrin and the dragon cult ruled over Skyrim. Here, the humans rebel against their dragon overlords, the legendary dragon war. Aldrin's defeat is the centerpiece of the war. Now, you see, here is fallen from the sky. The Nord Tom's masters of the voice are arrayed against him. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that why we're here? Ah, patience, my dear. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in allegory and mythic symbolism. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. You mean they used a shout to defeat Alduin? You're sure? Oh, yes. Presumably something rather specific to Dragon. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all they knew of Alduin and his turn. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. Oh, I got you a few shouts. A, thing. a <laughs> shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? Maybe. The Greybeards might know. 
You're probably right. I was hoping to avoid having to involve them in this, but it seems we have no choice. What do we have against the Greybeards? If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the Civil War or done anything about Alduin? No. And they're afraid of you, of your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? Hmm. The Greybeards may have a point. Power is dangerous. Only if you don't know how to use it. All the great heroes have had to learn to use their power. Those that shrank from their destiny. Well, you've never heard of them, have you? And there are the villains. Those that misused their power. There's always a choice, and there's always a risk. But if you live in fear of what might go wrong, you'll end up doing nothing. Like the gray beards up on their mountain. I better go see what Arngir knows about this show. Right. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. Not likely they'd help Esbern or me if we came calling. We'll look around Skyhaven Temple and see what else the old blades might have left for us. It's a better hideout than I could have hoped for. Talos guard you. Look here uh. in the third panel. The prophecy which brought the Akavirich of Tamriel in the first place. In search of the Dragonborn. Here are the Akaviri, the blades. You see their distinctive long swords. Now they kneel, their ancient mission fulfilled, as the last dragonborn contends with Aldred at the end of time. Are you paying attention, Delphine? You might learn something of our own history. Yeah, you. Do you need something? What do you have against the Greybeards? If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and oh, talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. Right. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the Civil War or done anything about Alduin? No. And they're afraid of you, of your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? So this is all the blades. Two people? The Thalmor hunted us down, remember? It wasn't exactly great for recruitment. But we have a headquarters of a sort now. We will rebuild the blades. Someday. Okay, maybe I can help you find new recruits. If you find anyone you think would make a good recruit, I can certainly take a look at them. Remember, okay. though, being a blade is a lifelong commitment. Their loyalty has to be with us once they're in. Yeah, that's right. Who are the Thalmor again? The faction that rules the Aldmeri Dominion. The ones who almost destroyed the Empire during the Great War oh, 30, 30 years, years back. back. That's right. There's no worse enemy to humankind in Tamriel. The Empire barely survived the last war. The Thalmor don't intend to lose the next one. So why are we... So why are they hunting you? When I was young... Our leaders became obsessed with the Thalmor threat. They believed that if and when we found a Dragonborn, we would need to protect him against the Thalmor. Turns out we fatally underestimated the Thalmor. They smashed us with ease during the Great War. I was one of the few who escaped. For a long time, all I cared about was staying alive and taking revenge on the Thalmor when I could. But then the dragons returned. And I remembered that the Blades used to be Dragon Slayers. And that we were sworn to protect the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer of all. Hmm, <laughs> cool. See ya. I know the prophecy in my heart. Hey, Al uh, Esburn. Did you need something? What's so important about me being Dragonborn? Haven't you been paying attention to anything I've said? Yes, I have. Only you oh. can finally defeat Alduin. Right there. And avert the end of the world. If we can just find out what shout the Lord Heroes used, you may have a chance. The unrelenting or not. force. There's no guarantee with prophecy. Merely hope. Oh, any advice for fighting dragons? You're in luck. 
There is a blessing the blades used on the eve of battle. It's supposed to prepare the mind for slaying dragons. Really? I doubt the blessing's effects would last for very long. So ask whenever you're heading out, and I'll perform the proper rites. Okay, I need that dragon slaying blessing. May the scales of the dragon kind splinter at the touch of your arrows and crack under the weight of your sword. That's all there is to it, Dragonborn. Good luck. Okay. Let's see this. Five days. Okay. When misrule takes its place at the eight corners of the 